Hello students, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I am going to explain you uh, writing skills topic that is report writing. Right? Let us go into this. Introduction. A report is a written account of past events or in other words, we can say it, it is a prepared talk about a particular subject. It is a vivid expression of a personal experience on account of something heard, seen, done, studied, etc. meant to be published or broadcasted. This is what the introduction. It is a written account of the events that we have seen or read or studied anything. Right? That is what report. We write the report of what happened there. There are mainly two types of reports. One is school magazine reports and news reports. These are the main topics prescribed for class 12 English. <clears throat> now, how to write uh, school reports? First, we will go into the school reports. That is how to write them. Format. First of all, the first one you have to write is heading. So, this is actually placed in the middle of the page. No box is required. Remember this. Just you, you should place it in the middle of the page. And should be catchy. Most probably it should be catchy. So, if you can't get the catchy titles, don't waste your time. Just don't, don't ponder over time there. That's you leave it. Simply you can give the title. And next, just below that, byline. Name of the reporter is written here. The person who is uh, reporting it, that person's name. You have to mention it is written just below the headline next to designation the reporters designation just below the byline also can be mentioned and next content usually uh, this content occupies three to four paragraphs let us see how those three paragraphs are uh, maintained yes paragraph one consists of the basic details about the event such as what happened where it happened when it happened who did it who attended it Sometimes you can write like why it happened, right? So this is what you can mention. Next example here, uh, a sports meet was organized in Maryland High School, New Delhi on 19th December 2022 or 2023, 2024, anything can be possible. It was organized by class 12 students with the support of principal and the staff. PV Sindhu had been the chief guest for the occasion. See, when you observe this statement, what happened, where it happened, when it happened, and who came and who organized it. And one more thing, mostly past tense is used here. So, while writing the reports, you have to use past tense. Next, paragraph 2. Paragraph 2 must narrate the events taken place in sequence, one by one, how it happened. Okay. So, for example, the program started at 9 a.m. with the lamp lighting ceremony by the chief guest. So, generally... <coughs> Here, school magazines, school reports are written for annual day celebrations, sports day celebrations, or any other uh, cultural day celebrations, food fest celebrations, like this. So, most probably, all the events start with some uh, formalities like uh, lightening the lamp, these ceremonies. So, like this, you can continue. And later, what happened? Who delivered speech? What is the essence of their speech? And next, who spoke? And next, uh, who came as a chief guest? What was his address? Like that, one by one, you have to right in the second paragraph next to para 3 final paragraph should include include how it ended up so for example you see the program ended up at around 6 pm with the word of thanks by nandini of class 12 the event had been a huge success with thunderous response from all the people of the different schools in the city like this you can end most probably first paragraph and second last paragraph normal so mostly it is what happened where it happened and how it ended in the last paragraph but the second paragraph should be the main paragraph here you can give clear details sometimes that's what i told you three to four paragraphs we discussed three to four paragraphs means first paragraph and the last paragraph as usual but second paragraph if possible you can go with two paragraphs that is so in second paragraph itself you can go with the other paragraph also that is what the main theme Next uh, example is here. Recently, your school held a seminar on conservation of water as a part of World Water Day celebrations. As the head boy of Maryland School, Hyderabad, write a report in 120 to 150 words for your school, school magazine. You are Kiran or Kiran Mike. So, this is how the question is given. 
and here world water day is the title and next if you see uh, here kiran it is the reporter's name byland this is headline and this is byland and here it is the designation and here this is what the three paragraphs we mentioned here a seminar on water con conservation was held on 15th january 2023 or 2024 in maryland school hyderabad as part of the world war uh, world water day celebrations the main aim of this seminar was to remind us all about the importance of water as it is a precious source imperative for our survivals next uh, second paragraph here it is the details distinguished uh, environment uh, environment list and uh, eminent personalities were the guests guest speakers and uh, they reiterated the need not only of conserving water but also spoke at length on how to conserve water by stressing upon the fact that each drop of water is precious dr wangari matai an eminent uh, environment list suggested a uh, rainwater harvesting as one of the best ways to conserve water using visual aids to highlight her uh, discourse she suggested that to ensure availability of water for the future generations the withdrawal of fresh water from an ecosystem should not exceed its natural replacement rate the seminar concluded on the note that water conservation is the most cost effective environmentally sound way to reduce our demand for water and so each one of us must do our bit towards improving water management to enhance optimum use of water that is how we can write the school magazine reports next if you go for the news reports so there is only one difference between the school magazine report and the news report and this is written to report a fire accident a road accident earthquake or any landslide or any public events or a, a government policies etc something like that there is a slight difference between school magazine report and news report let us see that see as usual headline so catchy and short the first one is headline second line is byline name of the reporter and here you can go with right here you can go with uh this uh, reporting place and date this is the difference here reporting place and difference so only this difference you can make out the other details as usual three paragraphs format common here you see paragraphing organization that is uh, introductory paragraph one or two that means uh, one or two body paragraphs including event details and concluding paragraph inclusive of witness accounts so that is how we can maintain first paragraph second paragraph and third paragraph first paragraph is called as introductory and the last paragraph is called as concluding paragraph and the middle paragraph can be the body paragraph main paragraph and the following questions must be answered in the report what are the questions that we must answer reason why the program was launched or why how or why the accident took place something like that and uh, organized by whom see if any event it is how it is organized otherwise Uh, who did this accident who who is the cause for this fire accident a road accident like that when it happened who attended for example any uh, program who attended it if any accident who are the people uh, witnessed it and something like that you can mention and event details refer to the clues most probably in the examination clues are given so based on that clues you can develop your answer conclude including witness or the participants accounts okay if it is any event participants if it is any uh, some uh, accident something like that i witness their uh, opinion and all their report also can be taken in the final paragraph yeah this is what the example uh, your state government has banned the use of plastic bags but people are using bags still extensively an awareness campaign was uh, held by lions club on 10th march 2023 uh, or you are Amar, a reporter of the National Hello, write a report in 120 to 150 words about the camp. So here, as usual, same title. Ah, uh, by Amar, the staff reporter, by line and the designation also had been given here. And next here, this is what the difference. Bangalore, 11th March 2023 or 2024, anything can be possible. So place date has been mentioned here, but in the school magazine we have not mentioned this place date. 
and in the opening paragraph as mentioned what happened where it happened when it happened who attended something like that an awareness campaign was held on 10th march 2024 by lions club bangalore this campaign highlights the issue of plastic bags and its ban this is what then and then here as usual uh, what is the uh, what are the disadvantages of using plastic bags and uh, how they cause damage to our environment everything is written here thus you can go with the news report also i hope you understood the video and uh, you understood the topic very well and if you like my video please subscribe and thank you